Hi everyone, uh, today we're going to talk about how to change the look of Kodi skins itself. So the one you're most used to is called Confluence and a developer by the name of Hushim has modified the same look but giving us uh, more of these shortcuts down here. So currently we can have five but with his modification uh, we'll see a few extra menus plus the ability to put up to 25 of them here so let's get underway and show you how to do it we're going to open up Kodi obviously then navigate to the word system you can tell you're on system by the uh, highlight blue then we're going to go to file manager if you haven't already installed the Hashem repository as they're called this is how we do it so you're going to scroll all the way down to the word add source hit enter or OK on your remote control and when it's highlighted this box that says none in the middle hit OK or enter uh, if you're using a mouse you'll have to probably double click and then just type this in http colon forward slash forward slash repo r e p o dot hushem h u s h a m dot com very easy one once you finish typing that in hit the word done and then down the bottom here if you put a period in front of the word it'll be closer to the top of the list that you install just name it hushem and then down and press OK once you've done that. That's our first step. Uh, just exit back one. We'll come back to the main page here. This time we're going to go from system to the word settings and then to the word add-ons highlighted in white there and we're going to install from a zip file. If you by chance are not in this screen, for instance, you might have something that looks like this. Two little dots at the top there will actually go back one page rather than back to the main menu. So there we go, we go back out until we see this screen and we go to install from a zip file. From there all we need to go is all the way down to the word dot hushem, if that's what we named it, and press OK. And then you want to put the uh, highlight over the word repository.hushem.com minus 1.1.0003.zip. This is where the apps are located in and you're going to download it in the form of a zip file onto your device. Once a little pop-up in the corner comes up like so, we now have to go and install from the repository. So we go up by one. And these are all the repositories that have been uh, installed by me on this device. Uh, you might not have as many. So what we're going to do is just scroll down and until we can find hushem.com repo. Highlight it and press OK, enter. Now we're going to change how it looks. So we're going to the look and feel. If we were going to put an application for a video, we would go to the video add-ons instead. In this case we're doing a skin as well and then uh, the confluence so we're all used to what it looks like uh, but it's just been modified once that's done you press the word install let it download once it's done that it's going to pop up and say do you want to keep it would you like to switch to the skin in this case we say yes because we know it's going to look exactly the same as uh, confluence but we're just going to have a few little extras there. Now that's all been done you can just press OK to get away from that and now would you, are we going to keep the changes? That's co Yes, correct. Once that's done we can just escape back all the way out to the main menu and you'll see some of the things look a bit different uh, instead of just uh, files and add-ons there under music there's files add-ons RAM, FM, radio, funk station. So these are just some extras that he's already put in as well. But if we go over to videos, we'll notice all of our shortcuts have gone. So it still looks the same for videos, but we've lost them all. Don't worry, all the apps are still in there. Uh, 
Now we're just going to go and put what apps we would like as our shortcuts. So we need to go to the word system. And then we want to go to settings. Then you're going to go to appearance. And this is true also just for the standard confluence as well. So it, there's no difference. We're, we're Via the skin is where we're going to find the shortcuts. So from there we need to press a right arrow to go over to the right once then down once to the word settings and press OK and then you'll see at the bottom here we've got general home window pointers background and we're going to go to add on shortcuts now you need to press the right arrow over and now you're going to be able to see all these add-on slots here are free for whatever applications or add-ons as they're called through this into one of those 25 slots so simple as selecting the very first slot scrolling down to find out which one you would like in first i have my paid service here and then i go down to the second one and then i find my next app that i like to throw in there usually it's the exodus app come back up and press ok over the top of it and carry on until you've filled up as many as you want in here. I'm just going to do a few more. put some Asian one here Just one more, I won't make it too much longer, otherwise the video will go forever. OLMN. We want something like Oblivion Streams there. Okay, now that we've done, uh, they're all saved there, so you want to press uh, back button, or return, or delete on the keyboard. We're going to come out to the main menu. Now this is all important, once you've got them all here, if you were to just shut it down by turning off the system, you would lose them all. So here you can see I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, lovely. In order for us to carry on and have them saved there, we need to go down until the on-screen power button is highlighted, which is a zero with a little strike through, stroke through it, a vertical one. And then we're gonna exit it. But exiting it, we are doing this properly and they're all going to stay, stay in there, especially on an Android device. Now we can relaunch Kodi. And we go over to the word videos and they're all there. And that's how we change skins. Now there are many other skins that you might want to play around with. If you're used to the Confluence skin like we just show here, uh, best to stick with that. Um, it is the most user-friendly one, uh, but there are many others out there that you can download as well whether they're themed uh, for sky or for movie channels um, have a play around with them if you like uh, remember if you do download them and you don't like them best to get rid of them because they can take up space on your device and just like any device that you load up with more and more content onto it the slower it's going to get it has to perform a bit more so try to keep unnecessary apps and stuff that you download off the machine if you're not intending to use it at all. So this has just been a really quick uh, lesson for everybody who would like to change uh, to a better version of Confluence uh, with more shortcuts. 
and uh, if you have any questions don't forget to just leave a comment below or contact me through my Facebook page uh, which is facebook.com forward slash Pukakoe tech support and have a nice day guys thanks for watching